Hello, so we are back here. Yeah? This is a quick video, a very quick one because Diana has to leave to pick up the kids from school. The problem with this one, the charger is plugged. Yeah, <clears throat> zero percent plug in or charging. Hopefully, you can see. Yeah, so this comes with this fault. It's a job from cash converters plugged in, charging. Okay, plugged in, charging. Plugged in, no charging. So that's the problem with this one. Plugged in, no charging. So actually, it's no charging. You can see the charger is plugged all the time, so we don't have a charger problem. The problem is the battery is not getting charged. So this is a battery issue. If it probably is the charging circuit, no, it's a battery problem. Yeah. So let's fix this problem. Plugged in, no charging. Yeah. Let's fix this one. If I take out the charger, laptop goes off like normal. Yeah, not charging the battery. That's the issue how this laptop comes. So we'll take out the battery, yeah? It should be quick then as to live. Yeah? How we can fix this problem? The problem is... The battery goes to... Too low. So, you can be lucky like the... Maybe I'm lucky and actually the memory is no lost, lost. Yeah, it's not er erased. Try to make two holes here. Yeah, one hole. Let's see, let's check the battery voltage. Nothing. Okay, we are not ready yet. Let's try now, yeah? And we have... 5 volts. You can see there on the multimeter, look on the corner, 5 volts. And that's not normal. So it's we minus, minus 5, that means the plus is here. Plus here, 19... Around... 2.5 amps, that's good. Plus is here. Minus is here. And the battery is taking 2.6 amps. You can see there on the corner, 2.6 amps. Let's raise the current, 3 amps. 4 amps should be fine, you know, our big elements should be fine for a few seconds, you know. You can't leave them with 4 amps. Let's charge the battery a little bit. So with 5 volts, it's very possible the memory to still should be fine. So we can bring this battery to life. Oh, low battery. <clears throat> so we can be lucky. We can be lucky. 4 amps, is taking 4 amps, yeah? 4 amps. Okay, let's try now, yeah? Should be enough. If we can check with the... Let's check with the... Multimeter, we have... 14.9 volts, you can see there, 14.9. I think we can power up the laptop with this voltage. Probably not. Let's plug the charger. <clears throat> Let's see if it's charging. Let's see, let's see. We just need plug-in charging. Plug-in charging doesn't mean the laptop will pumps the arms to the battery.
I made a video before how how you can recover the battery in the same way, making holes on the size of the battery. Twelve percent available plugged in charging. You can see. Yeah, let's see if it's charging. Thirteen percent. So the battery just start charge. Yeah. Actually, when you have that message plugged in, not charging, it's not charging. Yeah. But now, now it's charging. 13 percent yeah that's the how you can recover the the batteries it's not necessary to be a faulty battery you know maybe the voltage is too low if it's too low the internal electronics of the battery think the battery is faulty and you will not start the charging yeah that's great Let's wait a little bit. Fourteen percent, you can see fourteen. So it's going up slowly. I don't know if we can get the charger out because remember, yeah, the battery was like under the voltage for a long time. So we can try. Yeah, so the laptop is on. You can see so it's holding the charge it's holding the charge start again to charge yeah that's the way how you can uh, bring the batteries to life yeah only if the memory is not lost yeah it's not lost 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 yeah okay thank you for watching like and subscribe if you like the video yeah and see you on the next one yeah bye